Is smoking still a problem among teenagers? MyTimes.com Home page today's paper video most popular. Edition, U.S. Global. Search all MyTimes.com Education. World U.S. Politics Education Texas. New York. Region Business Technology Science Health Sports Opinion Arts Style Travel Jobs Real Estate Autos. September 6, 2013, 5 a.m. 58 comments. Is smoking still a problem among teenagers? By Michael Goncher. Spencer Platt slash Gabby Images e-cigarettes, battery-powered devices that deliver nicotine in an aerosol mist are becoming increasingly popular among middle and high school students. Go to related article. Questions about issues in the news for students 13 and older. See all student opinion. Cigarette sales are down by a third over the past decade, according to federal data, but some worry that flavored cigars and e-cigarettes are offsetting any dip in smoking among young people. Is smoking still a problem among teenagers? Is it getting worse? In the article e-cigarette use doubles among students, survey shows, Sabrina Tabernese writes about the growing trend among teenagers of smoking electronic cigarettes. The share of middle and high school students who use e-cigarettes doubled in 2012 from the previous year, federal data show. The rise is prompting concerns among health officials that the new devices could be creating as many health problems as they are solving. One in ten high school students said they had tried an e-cigarette last year, according to a national survey by the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, up from one in 20 in 2011. About 3% said they had used one in the last 30 days. In total, 1.8 million middle and high school students said they had tried e-cigarettes in 2012. Students, tell us ellipsis points. Do you know anyone who has tried e-cigarettes or uses them regularly? Do you know anyone who has tried flavored cigars or smokes them regularly? Based on your own observations, do you think smoking is still a problem among teenagers? Is it getting worse? Have you seen advertisements for e-cigarettes and cigars in different flavors, like watermelon or grape? Do you think these ads are targeting young people? Do you think the government should treat the e-cigarette and cigar industries differently from the way it treats the cigarette industry? Or do you think the Food and Drug Administration should regulate these products the way it does cigarettes? Why? Students 13 and older are invited to comment below. Please use only your first name. For privacy policy reasons, we will not publish student comments that include a last name. Student Opinion, Cigarettes, Smoking and Tobacco, in Related Posts From the Learning Network When should you be able to buy cigarettes, drink alcohol, vote, drive and fight in wars? Are anti-smoking ads effective? Adolescent Health Vertical Bracket Drugs, Alcohol and Tobacco Where there's smoke ellipsis points How would you choose? Previous post 6 cues about the news vertical bracket video games can improve brain function in the elderly, study says. From 1 to 25 of 58 comments. 1 to 3 next. 1. September 6, 2013 8.03 AM link. Is technology making us feel more alone? Almost everyone I know has a phone and it can be found in them almost all of the time. By doing this I have found that at lunch, during class, and pretty much any free time we have we are using our electronic devices to entertain ourselves. This, when you think about it, is getting us in the habit of socializing with our friends through electronics instead of taking to people in person. Sadly at times I find myself doing the same thing. This is leading us towards a world of socializing through electronics which is leading to a world of loneliness. M-KLB 2. September 6, 2013 9.08 AM link. I go to an all-male high school in Michigan. A problem at my school is less about e-cigarettes and more about hookah. I do not know many kids that smoke cigarettes or electric ones either but probably 50% of my school has tried hookah. They are convinced that these things do not cause any long-term